what you talking about now, Saint? I don't know, but you're going to get some nuggets out of it, though. But first, make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn that bell on. There's a new video series dropping every Friday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time with a random jam session whenever I'm in my bag. You do not want to miss out. Also, be sure to check out my books, man. The link's in the description below right along with my vegan class if you're trying to go plant-based and stay plant-based. I'm telling you, it works. Oh, and lastly, be sure to follow me on Instagram at underscore just underscore seen underscore. The nuggets I don't put over here, I put over there so you can always always get me when you need me but you ain't really coming for all of that peace love knowledge and freedom i'm out stop being so stop being so focused on people that can put your ass to bed and start focusing on people that can wake your ass up feel me focus on relationships like that feel me because then you transition from lust and shit to love you know what i mean Build a relationship off love and it, it lasts forever. Real love. The power. Not that bullshit that's got you stuck in your feelings and shit and your emotions. You know what I mean? But that's that. You feel me? Change. Get your relationships right, yo. And if if this <laughs> If this fucked up any relationships, you feel me? And now you, it's caused you to see your partner, your significant other differently. And you realize, hey, I got to cut it off. That's not my fault. Y'all shit was already fucked up, okay? It was already fucked up. Don't put that shit on me. All right? Ain't like, because I know right now, it, it it's going to be a lot of motherfuckers that end up single after this shit. But it is what it is. Don't put off tomorrow what you can do today. And that's not a that's not something out of misery or anything like that. That's something out of love and logic. If it's being if, if it's bringing you pain, it's bringing you down, it's causing you turmoil, it's causing you trauma. You don't need to be in it. You cannot grow in trauma. You cannot grow through trauma. You cannot grow through pain. You cannot heal through the shit. You feel what I'm saying? Your goal in life is to progress and to be better. You know what I'm saying? And the best way, the only way to do that is to connect with relationships that give you that power. Be involved with relationships that take you to that level. You know what I mean? Always be in a position of continual elevation. You know what I mean? If you have to restructure your relationships with your family, do so. If you need therapy, you need counseling, go get that shit. Go get familial counseling. Stop stop being stop being in denial of the shit and letting that ego get involved. I know it's 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 stupid to to continue to hold on and harbor that shit into your into your um into your heart. You know what I mean? And then try to build relationships like that. Because now you create kids that do the same shit. That's how cycles continue. We need to stop this shit. We need to stop this shit. Because I'd be damned if I bring some kids into this world and they interact with your kids and your kids are still stuck on trauma and my kids ain't and they fuck my kids up and we, we got a problem. We got a problem because now this affects the forward movement of our people. Feel me? So, choice is yours though, but this is what it is. Build, build your relationships. Work on them. Make sure they are better. Make sure they are perfect. Make sure they are potent. Because they can all they can be all of those things. You know what I mean? But start with self. Develop and build your relationship with yourself. Um, find your love language. Find the way that you love. If it's a negative love language, change that. Alter that. Begin to work on that first before you get involved with somebody. When you have a positive, healthy love language, find that in other people. Find people who can match your love language. And then it goes from there. And then relationships work every single time. <laughs> every single time.